Hello friends and welcome back to Frontend Pathsala. In this tutorial, we will learn how to create date picker using React Material UI. This is how the page will look like after implementing date picker. So, without delaying, let's get started. I have created a folder called MUI-DatePicker and have opened the same in VS Code. Now let's go to Terminal and create our React app. Let's navigate to that folder. So give cd MUI-DatePicker. Now give the command npx create-react-app then react hyphen mui hyphen date picker followed by dash dash template and typescript let's wait until the command completes After the command completes, now let's install Material UI. For that, head over to MUI.com Docs Material UI and then Installation. Copy this command and in our terminal, first navigate inside the project folder. So cd react-mui-datepicker and then paste this command over here. Run this and let's wait until it's done. After the command completes, let's run the application using the command npm start. So our application is up and running. Let's go inside the source folder and open app.tsx file. and delete these lines of code. Now let's import box from material UI. Let us give here box and inside box will give typography. Let's give the text as MUI date picker and variant is equals to H5. So you can see the text MUI date picker will just give some styling to the box. So style is equals to padding as 20 px. In order to work with date picker, first we need to install the date pickers. So for that, we'll go to new terminal, navigate to the folder cd mui date picker. Now navigate to the project folder cd react-mui-datepicker. Now let's install the date picker. For that we'll give the command npm install mui x-date-pickers. hyphen 
so it is installed now in the next step we have to install an adapter so for that we'll give the command npm install dejs So now it is ready for use. First we need to import localization provider. So for that we'll give import localization provider from MUI x hyphen date hyphen pickers localization provider then we need to import the adapter so for that we'll give import adapter day js from mui x hyphen date hyphen pickers adapter day js lastly we will import the date picker so import date picker from mui x hyphen date hyphen pickers date picker Now come down and after typography let's give localization provider component inside localization provider we have to pass a date adapter so we'll give date adapter is equals to adapter day js after that inside this we'll give date picker in date picker let's give label is equals to select date So now we are done with the configuration. Let's check this in the browser. So the select date is visible in the browser. Uh, let us just give some spacing to it. Let's add the same padding to the typography. Now it looks better. Now let's test our code. On click of the icon so you can see that the date picker is showing up. So guys with this we have completed this tutorial. Please don't forget to give your feedback in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching and please do like share and subscribe to my channel. Bye.